The News 4 Tucson investigators have learned about a reorganization of an important consumer unit serving Southern Arizona residents. Yes, investigator Matthew Schwartz spoke some former unit attorneys that think it is bad news for consumers. People from the Tucson area could come in and file complaints in person. They could meet with a legal assistant in person. And it, that's not going to, to happen anymore. Noreen Matz is concerned and says Southern Arizona residents who are victims of consumer fraud should be too. Matz ran the Attorney General's Tucson Consumer Fraud Litigation Unit from here on West Congress Street for 23 years before retiring in 2014. Now, the News 4 Tucson investigators have learned that Attorney General Mark Bernovich is reorganizing the office. No lawyers, paralegals, or legal assistants will be working in the Tucson Consumer Litigation Unit as of the end of this month. I think it sends a message to Southern Arizona consumers and maybe even to the whole state that it's not that important for there to be the face-to-face -face contact and the day-to-day -day activity to help consumers. The unit once had five attorneys and was highly regarded nationally. It was still effective recently with one attorney, two paralegals, and a legal secretary. The attorney already left and the rest will be gone soon. Over the years, the unit shut down, fined, or secured settlements with countless businesses, big and small. It was part of a $105 million dollar settlement with Big Pharma's GlaxoSmithKline for alleged unlawful marketing, with Arizona's portion of the settlement being $3 million. Attorney Vince Robigo worked in the Tucson Consumer Unit from 2005 to 2010. Once uh, fraudsters find out that there is no consumer litigation unit here, it may become open season. I'm heartbroken. I'm discouraged for consumers because we did so many statewide and nationwide cases out of the Tucson office. Shortly after Attorney General Mark Bernovich was elected, he told us this. We're going to be much more aggressive when it comes to protecting the rights of victims. The Attorney General spokesperson Mia Garcia said in a statement, our Tucson office is open and ready to take consumers' complaints. We have attorneys working out of our Phoenix office dedicated to aggressively pursuing Southern Arizona consumer enforcement. Frankly, we hope the reorganization will result in more consumer fraud investigations launched out of Southern Arizona. And the investigations that we were able to do just by driving around Tucson, I don't know what will happen to those. The AG spokesperson says there will be three employees in the Tucson Consumer Litigation Unit, a clerk typist, an administrative assistant, and a non-lawyer investigator. The spokesperson said two full-time legal assistants in Tucson declined an opportunity to relocate to Phoenix. Vince Robigo says even if they had relocated, Tucson area consumers would not be well served. Those sorts of uh, uh, cases, are just not gonna happen when you are 120 miles away and, and you're just reviewing online complaints that people file. The former unit members told us they hope the Attorney General reverses his decision on reorganizing the unit. We will certainly let you know if he does. If you have a story you'd like us to investigate, email us at investigators at kboa.com or call 955-4444. Investigating for you, Matthew Schwartz, News 4 Tucson.